Good day and welcome to the channel. In this very short video, we're going to show you how to import a list of servers into Remote Desktop Manager. In particular, because there are several of those, we're going to be using the Microsoft Sysinternals RD Manager. So uh, let's get to it. Uh, here we have a list of 26 servers and uh, I've exported this as a CSV. So URTechServerList.csv. And what we need to do is go get uh, Remote Desktop Manager. So type in Remote Manager and I don't want to use that one. There are several of them. I want to use the one from Sysinternals, which is this one here. And we just download it. Unzip it and put it wherever you'd like. I'm going to put it into my temp folder because this is just a test. You might want to put it into program files, whatever you want to do is fine. And just double click on it and so select file and new and because we have to create a group i want to save it into my c temp you can save it wherever you want uh, i will call this servers bingo there it is all right so select edit and import servers and browse and we have incorrectly formatted this as a csv but you could just change your uh, file type down here to wildcard and our list is called URTEC server list clever name there we go and we will import it and bingo there they all are pretty straightforward uh, when I say it's uh, the incorrect format it was looking for a txt file but uh, again we just used a csv it works fine one other thing you might want to know is uh, instead of entering creds for all of these one at a time because that's a giant pain go to properties uh, click on log on credentials, select set, uh, sorry, default uh, settings group. So click on that. You can enter whatever you want. So I'm going to enter URT admin IM. It's one of my uh, accounts. By the way, no, that's not real. And I'll enter my password. There we go. And the domain for this is local. And while we're here, let's go over a couple of other settings you probably want to set up as well. So let's go to uh, the gateway settings are fine. Connection settings are fine. Remote desktop settings. This is one that you probably want to change. So change it to same as client area. Profile management's fine. Encryption is fine. Display settings. I like these to be twice as large as they are. And I most definitely want this stuff to scale. Scale to fit the window. Scale to fit the window. And I also want to be able to interact with it. Uh, security settings and local resources. That's all good. Click OK. Click OK. Now, if you just close this, this won't be saved. You better save it. So click File in top left hand corner and Save All. And let's close it. And now when I go back to my manager, RDC manager, there it is. And were my settings maintained? I know they were, but let's just take a look here. Yeah, you can see uh, this is imported from the parent. So this is going to save a lot of time. Now I can bring up each one of these and the screen will resize as I click on them. It's very, very handy. Hey, if you found this video useful, please give us the big thumbs up. If you have any questions or concerns, you can get a hold of us directly at www.urtech.ca. That's www.urtech.ca. Or you can leave a question or a comment below. And if we don't get back to you, somebody else will. Because on YouTube, everybody's got an opinion. Thanks and have a great day. Bye.